the students playing their own work in the uh, school band and on the instrument. Some of uh, uh, the students' composition will be featured and showcased at our gala concert that is um, May 22nd. And I hope all of you will come and enjoy the concert. The next one, please. Ah, here. Professor Chan of Music is now teamed with Professor Chef Chan, Leo Chan. Is Leo here? Leo, where are you? Oh, there Leo. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> These two professors and award-winning professors of different fields are start are going to team up giving Asian Heritage Month lecture in school. <coughs> The first lecture will be given tomorrow. I hope you're able to get up. <laughs> tomorrow at Mother Teresa uh, Academy. They were classmates. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's right. And they are going to be team up, uh, taught in a joint lecture. So the lecture will be conversational and it will be moderated by the students of their audience. And they're going to talk about what happened. Oh, that, that's the end. Uh, they are uh, early age. The, and they were classmates in Hong Kong in the St. Paul uh, High School they started, but they chose a different career path and they ended up both successful and award-winning professors. And the reason they end up is, look at that, do what you love. That's the principle they've been following in life. And we think this is going to be very inspiring to high school students at this age. So wish them great success for tomorrow's lecture. The next friend. So here um, is the, the next uh, subject is storytelling. This workshop uh, uh, is delivered by a uh, Toronto historian and uh, uh, award book uh, writer, Arlene Chan. Arlene, please stand up, Arlene. <laughs> and myself, <laughs> we teamed up. And uh, we have uh, uh, given different workshops, uh, although under the same title, uh, to the students according to their levels. And also, we build our workshop into the uh, school curriculum. And the picture here, uh, were taken from uh, two workshops we were given to grade four elementary two schools in Jane and uh, Finch area. They seem to be underserved somehow, we feel, but we developed this uh, workshop <coughs> because the student's level is elementary. So the method we introduced is uh, um, from uh, picture to a verbal uh, or uh, presentation of storytelling. The students are uh, divided into three groups and also we have uh, pre-printed four pictures uh, also uh, in three uh, paper bags. And they were written beginning, middle, and ending. <laughs> So the three group of students will do relay. Each student will go up to pick up the first of all from the beginning uh, uh, bag and take our picture and start developing the story, the beginning of a story. And then their, their group will do the relay until they finish building up the beginning of the story. Then the, the second group will go pick up from the bag of the middle. Then they will develop the middle. And then the last group will go pick up a picture from the ending. And they, they will develop the ending. And, and the, in the end, we'll have the complete story, like a three paragraph story, the beginning, the middle, and the ending. So in a relay. So we had a lot of fun. Of course, um, just now, uh, Justin talked about in China, the movie only has the beginning and the ending, right? So you don't need the middle anymore. But we still try to build up the proper writing uh, structure with the students so we have the beginning, middle, and ending. Uh, Ali and I also worked with a large group of ESL uh, students 
uh, at Maria Ward uh, of Catholic uh, School Board, and um, some of our students writing, finished writing, are exhibited on the board there, and this is out of a manual, quite a few of our visits, as well as a one-on-one -on -one tutoring, editorial tutoring, and also with a very supportive teacher. So we finally produced that results. Um, we also have given to grade 12 high school students identity workshop, help them um, define and uh, analyze uh, identity, uh, many codes now uh, in, in, in our society. Okay, the next one, please. Okay, we still have two more workshops to talk about, but first we want to show you, uh, introduce the photography workshop. It's delivered by our photographer members here. Where's Philip Chen? Please stand up here. And also Linda Lai, 